What's up guys, 773 Kush here. And I know it's been a while, it's been about a month since I last posted a video, but I'm back and I'm here to post videos throughout the month of December, January, every month. But today we have a video on some GMO from Arise. I don't think I've smoked GMO from Arise in quite a while. I did have some Lemon Royale from Grassroots about a week and a half ago. And as you guys already know, Lemon Royale is one of my favorite strains in the Illinois market. The funkiness, the gassiness, just how pungent it is, is amazing. And I'm expecting that from this GMO from Arise. But if you guys wanna check out the package date, feel free to pause the video. Everything is labeled right over here. But it was packaged about a month ago, so it's fairly fresh. I do have a video coming out on my birthday, so about two, three days from now, depending on when I upload this video, I will do a video on some Peach Crescendo from Revolution, so really excited for that one. I haven't smoked any rods in about two months now, so yeah. If you guys are asking about my shirt, boom. It's the Brunch of Stoners shirt. The event was amazing. I can't wait to go to more. That's all I have to say, guys, but enough talking. Let's open up this GMO and see what it's smelling like tasting like and let's see what the high is going to be like with this GMO from Arise. So let's get it opened up. I already made it easy for myself so I kind of slid it open there. Let's pop the container open and one cool thing about the new Arise containers is completely opaque or completely white so you can't see anything that's inside the jar so we're going to be taking a look together today guys or actually I'll still let you guys take the first look. So let's open this up. Boom. That's what it's looking like. Kind of focus on here damn okay guys just from me opening this jar without even putting it up to my nose <laughs> wow 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 okay okay guys all i have to say like this is a really good batch of gmo the turps and everything is just like screaming from the jar as soon as i open it up damn gassy sweet funky pungent all of the above with this GMO. Honestly, it's smelling a bit more pungent and more like GMO than the Lemon Royale that I had from Grassroots. It's kind of crazy because that was my favorite GMO for a while. But enough talking. Let's get our Puffco. Let's grab our hot knife. And let's get to smoking, guys. Let's see. Let's scoop up a nice size dab. This will be my first smoke of the day. It's two o'clock right now, so. It's a pretty good time to smoke. Yeah. <laughs> I keep smiling and everything, guys, but if you could, I wish we had smell -o vision Just how good this GMO smells. Like, I wish I bought like five more grams, but unfortunately they sold out right after I left. So I feel like I got one of the last ones and I'm really glad I did. Yeah, that smells amazing, guys. But here we go. Let's drop our dab into the Puffco. Boom, there we go. It took a little longer than expected, but gotta charge up my hot knife. Forgot to do that before the video started, guys. But here we go. Have my mood lighting on there. Have my tough tether. Everything looking pretty nice with the Puffco. And I'm ready to smoke this GMO. That's all I have to say, guys. So, cheers. Taste is pretty much in line with the smell. Sweet, pungent, gassy, earthy, all of that. Yeah, guys, if you're looking for a strain that produces a really good body high, a nice cerebral buzz, a warmness behind the eyes, this GMO is in a class of its own. As you guys know, I do like Gorilla Cheese, the Blue Lotto, there's something about the GMO funk and the pungentness of the GMO that makes me love it so much. Yeah. I did grab this over at Dispensary 33. It was only 60 for the gram. 
Today is their seven year anniversary sale. So if you stay by this mystery 33, I'd highly recommend shooting over there. They can give you up some concentrate, some flour, whatever they have on sale. But this GMO is fresh, a really good batch. The high is amazing. The taste is amazing. Everything checks out with this GMO. In my opinion, I've been enjoying this GMO a little bit more than I like the Lemon Royale. I mean, the batch was pretty good, but it was a bit more saucy. And I really don't like sauces. I'm more of a butter person, more of a sugar person, or even a rosin. Something that can work with with the hot knife. Yeah, something like that. Yeah, guys, this is amazing right here. Like, there's one strain that could get me every time I smoke it. It's GMO. It's amazing. But peace out, guys. I'll be shooting another video pretty soon. Like I said, I have this peach crescendo from Revolution. I'll probably wait till my birthday to open that up. I have some Mendo Breath from Rhythm. And I also have this Tide Pods from Rhythm. I've heard nothing but great things about this nothing but great things so be expecting those videos pretty soon i will drop oh actually i do have some patches too it's something that you guys really don't see in the illinois market a lot patches a lot of people don't talk about these but put it on your wrist you put it on your foot alleviates the pain anxiety and everything for up to 12 to 18 hours so this is a good product right here guys but again peace have a good one